Hello again, this is your host Pearls doing my Let's Play of Drought History Month, and we are in the middle of Red 13's uh, Journey to Retold entry, and uh, I'm kind of dealing with this Slayer here. I need to, him to hit this thing. I think I have a feeling I need to... Uh, what I actually need to do... It's, uh, no. See if I see one if you're if you stay reasonably far away from a slayer and they're facing in a direction they'll follow their wisp path without rotating, kind of like that. You can see. So I think I need to have them. Uh, let's get them up here. Yeah, like this. And then I just will deal with it like so. So hopefully he follows the path and manages to. He'll get stuck there, but at least I'm I'm inside now. Okay, now there's Wubba's here. I don't know if that's good or bad. I don't think it's bad. I'm going to go ahead and assume I don't need the Tar Mother alive. Um, there aren't any checkpoints in here, but... Well, yes, there are. They're under the Tar. I really should turn on my Alpha Blending, or turn... Or, uh, Tar... Whatever it's called. Um, but I'm just... Just not into that. Really, all the time. Okay, cool. So far, so good. This should go. Okay, now this this gets this might get a little dodgy, depending. Uh, I really would like, yeah, the wobbles are gonna protect me, like wobbles are supposed to do. Yes, God, I love wobbles. Perfect, bingo. Get away, Slayer. I'm out of here with my wubba lovers. Oh, <laughs> derp. <laughs> uh, oh man. So now uh, this is the um, the TCB entrance. He didn't really change too much about the the walls. Looks like yeah, these are all just follow the same style, but that's okay. Uh, adding the lighting, the mirrors, the rock giants, platforms. Gel, even Briar. Wow, just a little bit of everything in here. This is good. This follows the spirit of what I'd like to see. Uh, however, this isn't immediately apparent what it needs to happen. There's a lot going on here, once again. Uh, so I believe if I get this guy to follow me up here, he'll get himself killed on this thing right here. I don't know what that really does for me. Looks like I can't even progress without doing some stuff here. I'm actually not sure. What does this all mean? This is all a bunch of ore mites. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, I learned something. In the new Drought Engine, you have something called um, Puzzle View, if you press F3, which kind of makes navigating on stuff like ore mites a lot simpler. So that's good. That might be handy in here. We'll see. Boy, I really... There's a Conquer token, too. <laughs> it's like every element. This is good. I like this. Except I don't see an Omblick, which I am not going to complain about. Not even a little bit. Um, hmm. I don't know what's the deal with this mirror, honestly. It's kind of confusing me. I can't tell... You know, I just, I can't quite see it yet. There's a secret here? Oh no, I guess that's another place to kill a rock golem. So once I pass here, this opens up, and I have to probably book towards this exit, probably, the conquer token. I don't know if that's actually going to be an issue. Eh, we'll find out. Alright, so I'm going to just kind of wing this. Oh wait, what opens that door? Oh that, okay. Oh, you know what? I bet. Hmm. Huh. Those kind of make sense that I would. Well, maybe not. Why can't? I? Okay, I'm gonna figure out why I just can't stab him there, and can't just do this. And do these do anything special? Uh, anyway. OK, 
Okay, because he's just going to get trapped right there. So I definitely need to get this uh, blocked off with the mirror, probably. Probably. Um, let's just assume... Yes. Okay, so... Oops, let's back up a little bit there and stab this guy again. Let's see if this makes a difference. Uh, oh, you know what? I might need to keep him alive. Maybe that's the secret here. Because when I go through here, this isn't going to actually open up. So I need probably need him to... Yep, that's exactly what I need. So what opens up? And now it all makes sense what has to happen here. Okay. He needs to be one longer so that he doesn't do this business. Which means I need this guy. This is okay. This is all coming together and quite cleverly, nicely, nicely done. Red thirteen. Uh, oops. Uh, but how do I make? Okay. See, so they can eat the rock golem remains. I'm ninety percent certain. However. However, hmm. Well, this is a good puzzle right out the door. I need to like bring this with me or something when I go about my business. Right? I don't know how to get that stuck there. You see what I'm saying? Like, if I, if, okay, to bring the rock golem north on this path, because rock golems are stupid and get stuck around edges. Oh wait, no, I'm I'm ridiculously dumb. Herp derp. Okay, I, this should be fine here. So you come with me. Oh wait, hold on. Is that where I wanted you to be? I don't think I can actually put you back in position without doing something really strange. Hmm. No, I am... reasonably sure. Oops. Somewhere the puzzle is in here. This is beautiful. I really like this. I really I'm digging this a lot actually. Um so I'm gonna get this in position like here so that I can uh, let's leave you there. And leave that there and see what happens. So he should turn, because I don't think that was push. Uh, except I need to wait until they aren't going to have E-Press so 1, 2, 3. Uh, so it starts with... Uh, H that's V, H, V, right? Mm. No, it's H, V, H. So I need to wait till like, here. There we go. So he has enough time. Now this is interesting. I feel like this is a clue. Or I need to shorten him again or something. Because this allows me to toggle this once. Bring in the... <coughs> seldom used... So he... <coughs> and then... I don't know why. It's just a feeling, you know? Ah, that's why, because he needs to be able to come off of this in order to, I think, allow me to get out here. 
and then I can kill him there. Okay, so now I feel like I'm on the right track. I think I've solved this little mini puzzle, which was brilliant, by the way. This I really, really, really enjoyed this. Like, 10 out of 10, great puzzle. This part, however, I'm probably going to get real mad about. I do see a little secret room that gives me a little bit of more breathing room. I don't know if this is actually going to help. Else? No, that shouldn't matter. Hmm. Okay, I think, I mean, I don't see why that not, that's not a problem, okay? Or, I, or rather, I don't see how that could be a problem. Alright, so this gets a little sketch. Now, those briars are going to grow, oh wait, I, I need to do this right by myself just the right amount of time. Where I'm standing, like, maybe here, just go with there. When it's pretty much opportune to do so, so I don't know how many turns I'm going to need to get over there. But I feel like I've wasted too many already. Oh, this is just a problem. Hold on here. Uh, so I need to get to that conquer token, so this is definitely not the solution. Uh, right, so let's... I'm going to give myself as much time as possible this time. Because now I realize I can stab his eye. Oops. I'm, as Skell says, walking like a drunk squirrel. Oh, that was not quite enough time. Uh, let's see if I can't... Nope, so one turn wait, move. Not even worry about the gel. Oh gosh. That should clean up this room all by itself. So I'm going to leave them there because the briar will probably kill them. Hopefully. And this looks like a goblin maze, which shouldn't be too bad. I've been enjoying this. This has been a pretty fun room, not going to lie. Okay, so that looks clean. Everything over here looks mostly dead. Uh, this will free the goblin doing that, but I don't want to do that yet. I need to get him over to classic kill the... Oh! No, not like that. Um, hmm. Huh. Oh, I see what I think. I think I know what I have to do. All right, so come over here. So I'm going to get you to go over there. Up, 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 up. Or so I thought it'd be something like this, you know? Actually, here. You just stay down there. Uh. Well, this is suddenly very tricky. Hmm. I like my other solution a little better, honestly. Except he's not going to do that, is he? Hmm. See, now that time I don't know why he did it. Whatever. Sometimes that yeah, draw and goblin mechanics confuse me, but that's okay. The room is done. It was a really good room overall. Really liked it. Especially this. This was a good puzzle right there. Well done. Okay, we got... What, what does this make? Oh, it makes a, a clone, right? Okay, so this could be fun. This is a classic uh, Gunther and the Epic Blunder mechanic where there were soldier horns and... Um, 
clone horns, which no one knows how they were going to be. Now, Navi was clever. You could actually, you actually were beef or uh, gun throw in this one, but not this time around. So it looks like I have to. Huh. I, there's no red door, so I don't know what's going on here. This will be a soldier horn, which I don't. Wait, no, there is a red door. It's right there. Trapdoor gate. I don't think I'm smart enough to know. <laughs> now with clones, if you kill your clone, you you also die. I'm pretty sure. Yep. So you can't can't do that. How does this work? I don't quite. Is there? Oh, there's probably a secret wall back there. All right. That's almost helpful. Uh, let's go ahead and just take care of that then. Alright, so that one's pretty much useless now. So I want to use the Wraith Wing to get him in here. Well, that was not helpful. Uh, let's get you over here. Back this up a little bit. Get you. Can I force you away? Because I think you'll do better on that side. If I. You know, maybe not, actually. Let's get that back in the middle. Mm. Yeah, let's, just, let's just do that. See if I can't. Uh, this is going to be annoying. I can already tell. So he gets it easy right there. Oh wait, there's a secret wall. I wonder if that'll help. Uh, probably not until this is all said and done, right? I think I almost had it there. Oh, <laughs> look at that teamwork. Did you see that? I'm going to just back that up so you can see what happened there again. He retreats into the corner. I attack this roach while he attacks this roach because he's a freaking champion. And then he kills the last one for me. Awesome. Now the real question is, is he going to go commit suicide? Probably. So hopefully this isn't too big of an issue. But Oh, good. That's kind of nice of them. They had a secret door ready to go there. Oops. Okay, uh, right, that's cool. This, you know what though, this is actually a problem because he needs to go up there and murder those things. Which makes this really complex. Ah, oh, dang it. I, it almost makes me not want to use the soldier horn until he is. Because he's just going to go get murdered. Uh. Oh wait, there's another one. Herp derp. <laughs> I didn't even notice. Go murder yourself. Get murdered. Mm. Let's get this done. I love killing brain roaches so much. I'm being stupid about it right now.
There we go. That should ease it up. Like all Roach Queen puzzles. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now hopefully, he just goes on a murder spree for those things and it's no big deal. Uh, okay, and this should just clean this up. Perfect. Okay. Ah, breaking my chair again. Well, that was extremely fun. I that was that was wonderful. Red thirteen, really, really, really good. Uh, excellent entries. Lots of good, clever puzzles. Uh, I'm satisfied. Very good entry. Everyone said this hold was really hard, and I think it's just the unlimited undo that makes it really tricky. But uh, I'm having a great time. Uh, I did not create this. Uh, oh wait, yes I did. <laughs> I hope you like this tribute to Drod, Red Thirteen. Good job. I made this part. All right, so I'm out of time for the most part, but let's see where we're going to be heading next. Let's might as well, we might as well finish up this room while. Ow! Up here. <laughs> scares me so bad. Uh, okay. No. How did I do this? There we go. Just a little bitty. This is a place of memory by Soweko. So this is where we'll be going next time. I hope you enjoyed the video. This has been your host, Pearls. Uh, stay tuned for my next episode of Drod History Month. See ya!